choose a feed to obtain. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Alright. But I'm hungry. <sighs> hey, I stano. All right, I've just spent more money than I like have. Earned in my entire life on a breakfast burrito. Rage? Juggernaut? Okay. Conceptually, it seems like it would work. House bugs are free and full of protein. I have a Roomba that eats all of mine though. Also cats. We haven't had many bugs in this place though. Like the cats will alert to bugs and try to eat them, but just haven't been many. Thank you for the bits, Zerg McNuggets. Working on paying off my burrito debt. I appreciate that. Appreciate that. Does this make dog or not go? No. It certainly seems like it shouldn't, but it also wouldn't have surprised me if it did. There have never been channel points. Are these hallway fights so murdery? I think my health's going up. So, I don't know. They don't seem so murdery to me. Okay. I'm now a Juggernaut Strength deck. There are a lot of rides on this board. It's actually an okay armaments upgrade because anger, rage, or zero cost. There's a decent chance that if I play this, I get two or three upgraded cards played that turn out of it, which is just better than you usually get from an armaments upgrade. Yeah. I'm also sort of behind on upgrades. Weird deck. I don't know. We'll see. be weak with this battle fight thing. Woo! 
that's a good hand. Artem's pretty good with what I'm doing. Quite legit. I'll take a shrug then. Just beat Gremlin Knob. Might fight it again though. Wait, Beast Statue is excellent. This is not a very good turn one. I would describe this turn one as bad. Am I always playing Shrug? I play Impervious. Impervious Strike. I will also play Rage just in case. If I had a form card, what is the Wanderer's form card? I don't remember. Arcane the form? That sounds right. It, like, remembers three memories or something. At least me the sound also good with what I'm doing. Body slam and feel no pain. This certainly looks like a deck that wants a body slam. But... I think you take Feel No Pain anyway, even with like no exhaust. You just, you know, will get some exhaust at some point. You would have Idiot Form. Yeah. <laughs> joke, of course. I have arguably gotten worse at killing Gremlin Up. I think I've gotten significantly worse at killing Gremlin Up. Elixir is okay, though. So. Are you scared because you're bad, or are you bad because you're scared? Be both. Also, I have a feel no pain with Juggernaut for that. Stronger than I realized. This is Ocean Walk by Astronautilus. some options here. The 
are currently listening to a Pandora playlist. How confusing is that? I think I have to take Burning Pact over Body Slam and Dark Embrace here. Those are three pretty good cards for what I'm doing though. That's for sure. Okay, the Mario. It's just my first card draw, right? Dark Embrace is sort of card draw, I mean. <laughs> it's very optimistic. It's called Dark Embrace card draw here. Hey, Salmon. And Air's Eye. Wow. The spot weakness is very confused in this deck, but it seems to be doing fine, so... No complaints. with how little card draw I have. Definitely want Swift Potion over Gambler's Brew. And the Elixir is still doing things with Feel No Pain Juggernaut sometimes. Maybe you shouldn't have played those tricks. Yeah, maybe. No card is as good as me. Wow. Like, actually, none of them, though. What did I upgrade? Burning Pact. Oh, I should probably have played Armaments. Also, I should probably not have played Shrug. A couple of questionable choices there. decide when to play Anger. And just think about what will happen if I play it. And if I like what will happen, I play it. And if I don't, I don't. Blasty Blue! Oh, it's a barricade. It seems somewhere between plausible and certain that I need to take Emulate over that. So that, like, things will die, you know? Emulate seems like a very good card here. Barricade sure would be fun. I don't think there are any boss relics that make Barricade better than Immolates. Time to talk a Mac. What would mini Jorbs take if drunk? Immolate, 1 million percent. Not close. Hmm, the Barricade's so cool though. D 
Peace on the Snacko. It's all sorry. It's going okay. Wow, that's not a very good hand. Wow, that isn't a very good hand either. I guess it's better though. Soy Frost Galaxy. Juniper. Why don't I make a better hand then? Would you like to tell me about what hands were like when my grandparents were alive or something? Flame Barrier seems incredibly good. Do I even play this? I knew I was getting a I would still take Emulate over Barricade. Yep. Pull yourself up by the boot sequence. That's terrible. It's just pretty bad. I guess I want dazes though. I guess I should have made dazes. Let's get a dark embrace. And maybe a fiend fire. Definitely a Dark Embrace, though. Whether I want Fiendfire or Card Remove is a little bit tricky. Card Remove is very strong. Fiendfire is also pretty strong. I may have an unhealthy uh, attachment to card remove. I think I've been playing too much Watcher. Card remove is also really good with Sneko, though. Ugh. Ugh. Nah. Got some transforms or some upgrade alls. Nice. Upgrade another one, why not? I don't actually exhaust many cards. <laughs> Might be Flame Barrier. I will upgrade Feeling Pain at some point, it's just I have extra upgrades to sect, I think. Well, what about Emily? Sure. Eh. Don't know. Don't necessarily need Emily upgraded late game, whereas Flame Barrier and Feeling Pain are both good late game upgrades. I 
Thanks, Coiling Oracle. Carrying a bottle in Tropic Brew is like sort of funny, huh? It's not really it. I'd rather have one energy than a strike plate. Was it better? I don't know. Good fight, though. Darkstone Periapt has arrived. Shockwave has arrived. Thanks, Arcteus. Does this even hit anything? Clothesline and Ash and Immolate. Those are good upgrades. I don't care. Yeah, I'm not reading that, Z-Wubs, but I'm uh, happy for you, I think. <laughs> you mean no? There's got to be another way. This actually isn't a recording with trumpets in it. But it is... I'm pretty sure other than this not having the trumpets in it, this is the song that Day9 did the trumpets bit to. So I don't know where the trumpets went. Maybe there's one trumpets recording and one not trumpets recording. What did day nine do with the trumpets? I don't know. Remade it after getting roasted? Maybe. Possible. Feels like uppercut's okay, doesn't it? I do have bash clothes on and shockwave. But it's like hard for it to be really bad. Hmm. Can also upgrade it. I'm just not. Just not. Yeah. <sighs> Remember when I didn't upgrade this emulate? Jorbs remembers. Yeah. 
I cannot tell your neighbor's dog to shut up, but if I could, I would. Body slam good with Sneko Eye here? It doesn't feel like I'm blocking that much. I'd want an unupgraded one if I was taking one. Maybe okay. Probably not. Probably shouldn't have taken that. It immediately one-shots the enemy. Well. Hmm. It actually doesn't. Day 9 Trumpet's video is 12 years old. Just like me. Smark Berm. Maybe Smark Berm will help us. I feel like I used to go to the hallway fight to try to find like a rare or something there. I feel like I used to think about it. <laughs> Butcher has fucking painted me. I can play this song. And I can't play the other ones? One. It's worth paying one energy for that damage. That one was definitely not worth it. I had this big plan that I was going to spot weakness a lot in this fight, and then it would be easy to end the fight victoriously. I'm not sure it's working out for me so far. Yes. He still does, Cordelius. He's not dead. <laughs> He's not that old. Neither am I. You went to college with them? That's cool. Objectively cool. Hmm. It was better to play defend than bash. I 
don't know if I'm keeping Impervious for how good it is to draw, or playing it for how much damage it deals this turn. It does deal a lot of damage. Maybe things to 18 months. I'm weak this turn. I'm gonna save it. I want the energy next turn, I guess. Oh, weakness is popping off this fight. It is a card in my deck. It's about as positive as I can get. Okay. Alright. Now we're talking. Who's laughing now? Kopaka thinks the prime. That was a very good turn. An abnormally good turn. But if I had two Juggernauts, I'm not sure that really achieves anything. I was planning to bring it in here and eat it here, but like I took a bite and I was like, no, I will eat this all now. And then I did. I'm gonna take another Juggernaut. It's like a lot of my damage or something, right? This is a private event. Exactly. Were those the same options as at the whale? I don't remember. Tricodin, thank you for the 26 months. Maybe I should have kept the regen pot for second regen pot. Always like a thing that you can maybe do. Heart of Iron does seem better than it though. Heart of Iron seems better than like most of my potions, in fairness. Another strike remove, very good. Very good. Do not read this message or your channel will be put in lockdown. I should have played the defund. Why didn't I play the defund? Snack oil is pretty okay here. How good is a blood for blood plus? Eh. Looks like 26 months stricken. Then. I guess I can take Evolve. I draw 7 a turn, but that's not 10. Was that a useful observation? Uh, transform 2? And I can afford Bag of Prop. This is awesome. Gulen, thanks for the 13 months. I 
think I do that before Juggernaut in case I had armaments. That's how it worked in my head anyway. Feels weird not to have Mummified Hand right now. I feel like I have Mummified Hand with Sneko a lot. Or maybe I notice it more when I have Sneko? I don't know. I don't know. Those is all those all cost three. Okay. Okay. Those also all cost three. I just bought a metallicize. The metallicize is just to get Juggernaut procs every turn, just like deals 14 a turn once I'm set up, which is not that exciting, but it's fine. of burns. A rather thick nemesis. Somewhat thick. A little thick. I might need to liquid Heart of Iron. That's called Heart of Iron. I might need to do that this way. Meat on the bone. <laughs> hey, I ate your sandwich. I'm out of here.
When will I legally change my name to Jorbo? Literally never. This spot weakness has not been having a good day. That was not worth it. <laughs> It was terrible. Wow, okay. I find it funny that the last time I fought the jaw worms, all three of them attacked and my watcher deck couldn't block. And then this time all three of them don't attack and my ironclad deck makes 7,000 to block. That's sort of funny. A little bit funny. A touch comical. Thirty. Seven is my number. Can I take eight? Oh. I think I've lost interest. It was making me think too hard. Battle Trance has never cost less than three, I'm pretty sure. Maybe it's cursed. Maybe I should remove it. Remove Cleave before Reptivancer makes sense. That means it's due to cost zero? Good point. Actually, a really good point. Now it costs three again. It'll always cost zero when I get Corruption in play. Is this fight giving me Corruption? That would be really cool. I would love that. I failed to go low enough again. Uh, True Grid or Dark Embrace? How many Awakened ones? 0.5 Awakened ones. One, two, three, four, five powers. I'd sort of prefer a true grit. Can't upgrade it. It's just an unupgraded true grit. It seems terrible. Alright, let's take Dark Embrace. Pallets to remove Sneko Confusion? I think I like Sneko Confusion. Just another Impervious. My damage is sort of slow. Maybe that's okay though. Last time I got Reptomancer in Dead Adventure. Uh, it's not a thing that can happen, bro.
runs have been going well. Battle trance costs three. This fucking card. Oh, I could have like played Impervious and then Body Slam would have been lethal. It was impossible to tell. Molten Egg, just in time. The Rampage is upgraded. Taking Rampage to kill things is not actually the dumbest thing in the entire world here. It's pretty dumb. But I'd say it's like a 7 out of 10 dumb rather than like a 9 or 10 out of 10 dumb. We have Flame Barrier to kill the heart. I guess. I guess. Weren't we supposed to get corruption from that fight? It's on sale in the store. I had my mods vet the seed before I played it, obviously. I can tell you with confidence that we will get it soon. What is the dumbest thing in the entire world? I don't know. I'm not sure. What is the dumbest thing in the entire world? Anyone have strong opinions? I shouldn't ask that. <laughs> I don't want to know. <gasps> Cost zero. Oh my god, it drew me a dark embrace. This is a moment. This is a moment in my life. Cost zero again? Hello? Seems illegal. World running on fossil fuel is pretty dumb. That does sound like a dumb idea. These cards all cost 700. Don't know how I feel about that. I could have played Immolate. Searing Blow and Armaments work together? I mean, yes. The interaction works. I would not recommend getting too carried away, though. Order? Oh, I've already upgraded Searing Blow with Armaments. That's a thing that's happened. We did that already. We did it all already, so now all that's left is to find out all of the ways to lose that I didn't try yet. Because I already found all of the ways to win.
I see my question has resulted in us talking about the ruling class, as expected. I did not have to ask that, but I did. Use Searing Blue to upgrade armaments. I guess that's another way you could try. I am the 1% of Slay the Spire streamers. There are literally dozens of us. doesn't give off a significant tax-paying sort of vibe. We should probably consider that, like, life as a time eater might not actually be that easy, though. Oh. What the fuck does that even mean? I don't know which of my sentences you're referring to. But, like, I have no answer for any of them. Everything I've ever said is indefensible. Just an unpleasant truth about my existence. My meter is getting angry. Also, it turns out that Impervious has Exhaust, which I think is an oversight. I feel like that card would be better without Exhaust. Actually, <laughs> Exhaust is a pretty powerful word on Ironclad cards. Maybe that isn't true. I have a cat. Would I click on spoon? I don't know. I'd think about it maybe. I mean I can't afford it, so I guess I won't actually think about it. Never mind. Turns out that was a lie. This game has tried to give me blood for blood 700 million trillion gazillion times. Okay. I don't think I'm playing Feel No Pain necessarily.
Body Slam has been good twice this run. But gosh, I'm living for those two times. Full health. Essence of steel. That's probably good. Fiend fire seems really good. Probably. 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 Who wields also? A thing though. Do wield on feel no pain, juggernaut, metallicize. All pretty sweet. I think you'll do wield. Who needs fiend fire? Me, maybe? Possibly me. Drink, 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 drink. Eh. This one? Next turn? Be wait until the multi attack turn for that. Oh my god, it's the Game of Thrones theme. Hey, Handbuster! Wait, that's Game of Thrones' music. I didn't take a Fiend Fire. I might still not want Mayhem, though. That was a good decision. so skilled. Years of training. I feel that it is unnecessary to be fair about Game of Thrones. Being completely unfair about it seems reasonable to me. I could do dual wield stuff or I could not. I could play clothesline or I could not. Options. I like playing clothesline. If I play clothesline, the rest of my turn is sort of weird. Maybe it's just.
Wait, it's like dead already? This game is easy. That would have been harder without the barricade, for sure. I think we still won it pretty comfortably, though. I just sat down and run, f run, won four runs in a little under six hours. Good choice. Morning, bloody.